Dame Agatha's detective novel is a quaint, set in a Ruritanian Britain that is no more, and likely had never existed. Technologies make their debut. The car, the telephone, the radio, the electric light. The very nature of evil is transformed from the puerile directness of the highway robber and the passion killer to the skinning, cunning and disguised automatism of her villains. Crime in her books is calculated, the outcome of plotting and conspiring, a confluence of unbridled and corrupted appetites and a malignant mutation of individualism. Her opus is a portrait of our age, as it had emerged, all blooded and repellent from the womb of the dying Victorian era. Chris's weapons of choice are simple. A surreptitious poison, a stealthy dagger, a cocked revolver, a hideous drowning. Some, acquaint some acquaintance with the science of chemistry and physics is indispensable, of course. Archaeology comes third. But Christie's main concerns are human nature and morality. The riddles that she so fiendishly posits cannot be solved without taking both into account.